I grew up here in Utah Valley. We moved to Columbus, Ohio. And we got into the hotel about 3 a.m. with the U-Haul, my dad and I. And in the morning, he sent me out to get something. And then he found me maybe three, five minutes later, staring at the empty parking space where our U-Haul truck had been because it was gone. And I just was so confused, right? And I looked all around and it was just this disbelief. And he came out and he's like, okay, James, the truck has been stolen. And it clicked like, oh, my life is suddenly different. Same time the house we'd driven out fast to close on, something went wrong. And so we ended up living in a ward member's basement for a month. Wow. And so here I am 12 years old and I have a toothbrush and the clothes I was wearing <laughs> and whatever these strangers who were in my ward gave me. Mm -hmm. and, and I'm living in somebody's basement and that kind of thing. And just this week, I had a dream about that ward. And it, it still means so much to me that time when I had nothing mm -hmm. and was a kind of depressed 12 year old <laughs> trying to adjust. And that kind of thing created deeper relationships yeah. than the kind that I would experience if everything was just going well. And really for me, that, that moment we were, when we were not only poor in spirit, but literally poor is when I felt the kingdom of God and went, this is it. I'm, I'm in a village in God's kingdom and they took me in.